My channel if you're new here I'm Lottie a mama too and I was kindly sent some goodies from cherries I love this website they are an online store but very very cheap sort of like a pound land but online so instead of walking through town with all your heavy bags you can get next day delivery so you don't have to carry anything especially with the run up to Christmas and you're getting all the all the goodies and all the heavy stuff let the postman do it so if you sign up below as well they give us a free next day delivery I just think then what the word was free next day delivery and a voucher for um, some stuff off as well so the link will be down below. It's a lovely app, really easy to use, and they update it weekly, so there is new stuff all the time, and they've got all of their Christmas range. So it's very, very exciting right now. I went through, not gonna lie, and thought, what do I want? Not what do I need, what do I want? And I went, yep, yeah, all of the Christmas food, that's all I want, so I've got, absolutely tons of the stuff that your parents normally used to say you can't have that that's for Christmas you can't touch them saving them for Christmas Day oh no they're for when the neighbors come round for Christmas no 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 I bought it all and it's for me to eat <laughs> I'm gonna try and save it for Christmas but I do need to test some of them out need to make sure they are top-notch stuff so I don't think they'll last till Christmas Day, but I'll be happy in my own little way. So, let's have a look what I grabbed inside here. There are loads and loads of different things online. Food, house stuff, uh, um, organisation things, kitchen things, toys, makeup, health and beauty. Honestly, the list is endless with this website, this app. I keep calling it a website. It's an app. It's amazing, easy to use, and next day delivery. So, let's have a look what I got. Okie dokie. Right. Very excited. These are the Bendix Mint Collection. You know the ones that your nan used to have with the nice little foil on? You only ever allowed one, and then she'd slip you another one later on because you've been good. I've got them for myself. And I can smell the mint through the packaging. It makes me so excited right now. So these have got four different ones inside. So it's like a proper collection of different ones. It's very exciting. And yeah, I'm going to test drive these. Make sure they're up to scratch. Give them a go. And then try and save some for Christmas time. I doubt it'll work, but we'll give it a go. <laughs> Next are these yummy things. Bailey's Chocolate Twists. I thought these looked so yummy and really good to put in my hot chocolates square to cream with one of these these are light and crispy wafers filled with bailey's ganache now if you know me bailey's is the drink for christmas well drink for all year round really but for christmas yes and um they had loads of different bailey's stuff as well the truffles and then the milk bar and things like that but i've tried all of them and I wanted to try something new, something different, something that I wouldn't actually pick up. And I thought, yes, this is what I've been waiting for. <laughs> After eight, these are the bites. I haven't had these before. I love After Eight, and they always come out at Christmas. It's the Christmas go to thing. And I thought these would look really, really nice in like a bowl. Um, <sighs> You know, I say this as if I have like loads of people around. Oh yes, they're on the side in the bowl, darling. These are just gonna be eaten on the couch, aren't they, realistically? They're not gonna get to the bowl. But if they did, if I bought another packet, they would be look lovely in a little bowl. <laughs> Ready for everybody to eat. Um, but yeah, they look really nice. Kids are gonna love me. These are like a tradition in the UK. If you're not from here, I'm very sorry, but you need to get some festive friends. Like, it, you just have to, it's the law. 
Um, these are sold everywhere. They're delicious. They're biscuits with a little bit of chocolate on. And kids will eat the whole box if they could. They're so good. And you hardly get any in them, which is why they're only ever a pound. Um, but yeah, you could have like a box each. <laughs> they're really, really tasty. And it's just something that you get at Christmas time, isn't it? Like you have to have a festive friends at some point picked up some more twirls these were always used for our ice creams but now we're on to hot chocolates ice cream station is going out the window not out the window it's going away till next year but my christmas hot chocolate station is coming and i thought these would look very nice in the top of them for the kids to decorate just a couple of sprinkles or chocolate drops with a twirl on top of their marshmallows maybe and yeah put them in as well Another thing that the UK can't live without is palm bears. I mean, I even love them. Oh, the amount of palm bears we had growing up as kids. These were the go-to foods, weren't they? And they are just so tasty. So I had to get one of each because, you know, I, I just like a varied diet. <laughs> so I'm going with a pack of each. We've got some chop gems. They did have the icing ones as well, ice gems, but my kids don't like them. I don't know what happened there. I mean, ice gems and chocolate gems were the ones that you had in your packed lunch going up in school and you used to eat the chocolate off and then eat the biscuit because they were so good. So, grabbed a pack of them, always perfect for uh, packed lunches and things like that. Afternoon snack, after dinner treat, chocolate gems. I haven't had a club since primary school. Oh my goodness, I can taste it now. And they used to have mint ones as well. Do you remember the mint ones? <gasps> I love club biscuits. These are the orange ones. They're basically a thin biscuit with a thin like fondant of orange wrapped in chocolate. Mmm, so good. We're getting to the ginormous stuff at the bottom here. This time, it didn't explode so I'm very happy I think it was just the postman last time um if you didn't watch it I had a, another box from cherries they're really kind to me and it exploded over all of the stuff but it was like indented so I reckon that p the postman dropped my box and it just went and everything went it, it just went everywhere but this time sealed and contained hot chocolate I mean this is me down to a T, isn't it? Had hot chocolate yesterday, probably have one today. I just live on them. I'd rather have a hot chocolate than a cup of tea. Let me know down below, what's your favorite drink? Hot drink, not just any drink, hot drink. Here is where the weight of my box is. Are you ready? I can't even get it out, it's that big. Oh. We have gone for a Robertson's real fruit, apple and black currant. These are the ginormous family pack ones. I think it's two litres. Two litres for two pound. Something that you don't want to be carrying around the shops. I mean, this is very heavy. Wait there. And I also got the orange one. <laughs> These are no added sugar, which is great for kids. You definitely want to get one of them. Um, and the, I drink them as well. They're really, really tasty. And I just think they're great to have in their drinks um, for school and stuff. We've finished all of the food stuff now. So we'll go on to the household. Household items and see what I picked up there. My good old favourite, Astonish. Antibacterial surface cleaner. Kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria. Does it kill coronavirus? No, nope, it doesn't say, but it's cruelty free and vegan. So I always find that this is a winner in my eyes. Normally they're about 85p. I can't remember how much they are in cherries, but they're about 85p. And then you could pick up a Dettol, which is over a pound. And the bottle you could put like side by side. And the Astonish, you get so much more in. And I just think the smell of it is so fresh. I just absolutely love Astonish. Like you could come into my house and every bottle would be Astonish. Grabbed a new window cleaner as well. This stuff is amazing on windows. So all I'll do is spray it once. One little spray. Don't soak the window. One spray 
get a microfiber cloth and buff it out the whole window so like a ginormous window not a little one if you're doing a little one i'd spray the cloth and then do it um but this is streak free and it just makes them shine you can do it on mirrors as well and furniture that have like um so the top of my units where they've got the glass on beautifully shiny on there anything that's got a bit of a shine this is your stuff that you need to use We've gone for the Oxy Active Plus Fabric Stain Remover. A scoop of this in with your whites. Wow, do they come out shining. Um, not only do they come out shining like brightly white, but they do get rid of all of the stains. So mud and soil and food and blood. You know, if the kids have fell over and scratched their knees, it's just something that you've got to get out. Um, and this does it every time for us. So we are really, dedicated to this stuff elbow grease <laughs> elbow grease where do i start with elbow grease so elbow grease can be used for everything like literally everything um it's a degreaser it's also like a stain remover so you know when you're doing your windows and then they get that brownie black gunk inside of them this gone windowsills outside gone cooker hobs shiny again this is your stuff that you need to get through it and outdoor furniture i forgot about that last year we used this on our table and chairs you know when it gets dirty over the winter this got it perfectly shining brightly night uh shining brightly new again honestly it's amazing you need to grab a ball I've gone for two different hand washers this time. I'm not sure why. I normally click it and get two of it, but instead I've gone for two different ones. You can tell the size difference there, so I'm not happy with this one. These are Dove, Care in Hand, Cucumber, and Tea Scent. Ash likes Dove, so that's probably why I picked this one up. He has sensitive skin. Um, and yeah, the upstairs toilet we tend to have a dove in and then the downstairs we use whatever I think smells nice <laughs> So it's my choice for the downstairs and this is a honey one. Oh, that's beautiful honey and m Milk and honey, sorry antibacterial removes 99% of bacteria. Why does everything de delete delete get rid of 99.9% .9 bacteria what happens to that 1% that's still around? I don't get it, someone needs to explain that to me. Oh, I love it. Almond cream and hibiscus. This is what we use in the shower for the kids, for me, for Ash, we all use this. It's just so nice and creamy when you put it on your skin and you get that feel of like luxuriousness. Um, this is just perfect. You can use it in the bath so you can make bubbles with it for the kids and then they'll soak their skin that way or you could just use it on like a scrunchie and then buff your skin out. Oh, either way, heaven. And then a deodorant. I tried to grab the one that I got last time, but they didn't have it anywhere. So I've gone back to my good old favorite pomegranate. Pomegranate? Pomegranate. Not sure. Um, yeah, good old favorite deodorant. I just don't get on with sprays and I haven't since I was a teenager. I just... They're just no good for me and I always find roll-ons a lot better for my skin and for the smell. Um, so I go with these. Two toothpastes. We've got a Max White Sparkle Diamond and a Max Fresh Cooling Crystal. Again, why have I bought two? I feel like I went through the list and I just kept scrolling down and down and down and then there was another one I was like, Oh, I didn't pick up a toothpaste. I'll get that one. Whereas I should have probably looked in my basket and went, I've got two toothpastes. I've got two soaps. But never mind. We will use them. Um, these are Colgate ones. We always have Colgate in our family. And Ash likes the, um, the ones that are designed for stainings and things like that. Whereas me and Miles prefer the ones that taste really good. <laughs> ibuprofen you can also pick up some paracetamol as well um from the app and yeah i just thought these were great to have in the cupboard i was so poorly a couple of weeks ago for a couple of weeks as well it was a good two weeks worth and you just go through quite a lot of them when you're down especially when you've got a whole family it's just like oh draining but 
always grab some of them for the cupboard. Last but not least, blue tack. Grabbed this ready for the Christmas decorations. I'm going to give you an inside little uh, sneaky sneaky secret. Can't tell anyone. It's only because you guys watch the end of the video. You ready? Do you want to know what it is? Do you want to know? Our Christmas decorations are going up today. Shh. So the Christmas video is coming out soon. And we're going to use the blue tack to put things up and hang things there. I'm very excited. So yeah, don't tell anyone. It's just because you watch the end of the video. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, in the description box is all of the details that you're going to need for the Cherries app. Thank you so much Cherries for helping me make another video again, I absolutely love your website and your app, it's brilliant and so much easier than walking around town with all of this stuff. I mean I literally could not walk around town with all this stuff, impossible. So thank you so much and I hope to see you all again soon. Bye guys.